Events like London Technology Week are really important for bringing together different industries. Hundreds of events running around the city, some more technically focused, some focused on reading talent and encouraging people to get into the industry. It's a real opportunity for London and the UK to actually tell the story of the big tech revolution that's been happening in the UK. We're at Goldman Sachs today for the first headline event of London Technology Week 2015. We're having a series of lectures from business leaders who are working in the medical technology technology space. Today we are at Old Street Underground Station. We're occupying a pop-up shop as part of a London Technology Week, putting on a ton of really cool events related to tech design and business. And that's where we are today at the Old Shortage Station. This is the first coffee shop in the United Kingdom to start to accept Bitcoin. We thought this would be the perfect place to host a happy hour for anyone interested in the future of money. We deliberately chose the Royal Society because of the heritage and the tradition of innovation that it represents. A number of speakers coming across from Chinese technology companies. A lot of the events this week will be taking place in some of the more modern venues, accelerators and incubators that are spread across London. Uh, we're here in the Tanner Warehouse and uh, I've just been watching Jack Ramsey give the keynote on stretching digital boundaries. This morning we're at uh, an event uh, laid on by Accenture. It's looking at uh, digital disruption. We'll be talking about uh, mobile, we'll be talking about analytics, we'll be talking about cloud, and most of all we'll be talking about multi-channel. Okay, so we are in Bloomberg's headquarters for Europe and we are hosting London Technology Week here with our conference, Smarter Cities. London Technology Week is bringing together all these various exciting parts of the capital city and showing off what it's got. We're on the fifth floor of the John Lewis Oxford Street store in their roof garden, enjoying wonderful weather and um, all parts of the London Tech Week. We've got startups representing some of the categories in JLab, and we've got some very innovative food and drink, I'm being told. A liquid nitrogen freezing sorbets, some retro technologies being kind of rethought for 2015. So what's going on? World leading technologies, Kickstarter project, a computer you can build in 90 seconds. Over there you've got augmented and virtual reality. You've got Minecraft on the Raspberry Pi, stop frame animation. Get hands on with the latest technology. We have everything from a robot that will copy your moves through to an interactive table with tag recognition software. It's London Tech Week at the moment, and to be part of that and to be part of Interop, uh, which is the flagship event at London Tech Week, is fantastic. It's a really big exhibition, lots and lots of variety, lots of interest, lots of startups, and of course, lots of international visitors. Very interesting. We have an augmented reality solution. The wearable is quite cool. At the same time, it's a holographic lens, which enables you to see in front of you and beyond. The most exciting thing about London Technology Week is that it's open to everyone. The startup side to investors, through to academics, through to people in the ecosystem, it's not pitchy, where it's not salesy, is a really warm thing to do. The thing about London is, is it's where the creative people are, and this is where ideas are born. It's got great technologists, it's absolutely the number one place for programmers. We're able to bring on the hottest speakers, the people with the most expertise, whether they're the biggest CEO, whether they're the biggest politician, bring them together and start a debate. I'm also very happy as a woman to see more women to join, and that's something that has been quite a theme this week. Try and get to an event, at least one event. Get online, hashtag London Tech Week. And watch and observe the incredible innovation happening in this city. 